I'm gonna swing up on Kojak to mount him. Did you cut his mane? It looks I did. beautiful. Oh, oh, good Scott. job. Oh, it's been a while. Hey everyone, Katrina Stag here and Kojak. Say hi, bud. We're waiting outside the farm gate. I'm sitting in my vehicle because it's kind of chilly out and I'm trying to stay warm. But we are about to go tour the new property that I'm going to be moving into on horseback. So you guys are able to see what it looks like. I'm where some of my horses are going to go, which because I want some of them in my backyard. And before I go work at the house, I figured I was going to ride. And that's the reason why I'm taking you guys along. Oh my God. Come on, guys. Is that face so not cute? So let's get this started. And if you guys haven't already, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Give this video a thumbs up and turn on that post notification bell so you guys are notified every time I upload a video. But Co, let's go tour the property. Ready? I came out looking at something though while we're waiting for Jackie. What's over there, bud? That's where we're about to be riding. Isn't he so cute? How adorable is this horse though? You're the best ever. I decided to finally start oh, coming. Sorry. Yeah, what took you so long? Me and Co have been waiting, right, bud? We're bored. I'm gonna swing up on Kojak to mount him. Did you cut his mane? It looks I did. beautiful. I did. Oh, Ooh, good Scott. job. Oh, it's been a while. Such a windy day here, and it's gloomy out and pretty chilly, but. We are making our way to the property. Say goodbye to the farm for a little bit, Co. Because we're going to go to the new house where you're going to be living too. But how pretty. Y'all, it is so windy out here and it's freezing too. Um, and yeah. How cold are you, Jackie? Aren't you freezing? Yeah, we definitely are having a cold front tonight. It's going to be in the low 30s. So we're going to have to blanket pretty much everyone. But we're chilly. Oh, Jack's just checking out the goats. Wanna go see them? This is our neighbor, and she bought two goats from the farm. Look, Co, what are you gonna do? Don't tell me you're gonna spook. Look how pretty though he is. They're just baby goats, and you see them all the time. She said when, if we have babies, she would, she'd like to get another Look, one. there's like four goats in there, and then two horses. It's so cute. Oh my goodness. All right, let's make our way to the house. Come on. Let's go, buddies. I only have one hand, Co. So, and I'm riding bareback. And Jackie is too, on little Droopson. Hi, babies. So we're pulling in on the horseback. Here's the driveway to the house. The property line is all chain link fence. It goes all the way to that end of that tree, but we're gonna pull in here and walk it. I'm going to get a security gate when I move in here. So this will be all gated. And then that's the entrance that we're going to walk through to show you guys. But how pretty is the driveway? Big live oak. I love the trees. It's so nice and shaded. And Kojak, this is your future home. There's another little tiny fenced in area, which is going to be for my dogs and my goats that I move over, which will be Kramer. If you can zoom in, it's fenced in over there and it goes to the back sunroom. But right through here is where we are entering the property in the barn. And then it goes to that tree line. So we walk this way on horses. It is all fenced in this back property. I'm pretty sure about two acres is not fenced in. So the horses will have about four acres to wander and I'm gonna cut it off into pastures. And it's really pretty and shaded over here, but then we do have power lines on the property. So we have the big barn right over here that I'm going to make into some stalls. And so Jackie's looking at something. But if we come this way, Look how shady it is. It's so shaded, so beautiful. And obviously we have a lot of sticks to pick up, but we're gonna get to that this weekend and I'm going to do a video of picking the sticks up and clearing the property out because look how much property we have to clear. A lot. Beautiful. And if you look around, there are so many sticks. So back here is the barn. Imagine like two stalls over there, a hangout area, and then a center aisle barn. But look how much cleanup work we have to do. Oh my gosh, so much. But what a good horse this guy is. Just like going and exploring horseback through all of this stuff. And there's a little fence in area for the dogs. We come over here and it's fencing back to that line and then all the way over to here. So it's pretty shaded and really pretty. I love all the live oaks. I'm gonna take some pine trees down as well, just so the horses have more area to roam. But I'm not a big fan of the power lines. 
but you can't win them all, right? And believe it or not, down the, that way, there are, um, that's where the farm's at. So the farm like runs into this and yeah, but isn't this so pretty? The horses are gonna love it. Oh, Jack's stealing a snack. All right, bud. So I figured I would just give you guys a little tour and we're still walking the property, but it's all fenced in and horses can be turned out here already now, but I'm just not going to do it yet because I want to make sure that all the stuff's picked up and they don't hurt themselves. So walking it right now is pretty fine though. On this side of the house, there's the barn this way. And then it's all fenced in over here. And believe it or not, we actually have an irrigation system over here. So I'm gonna make it like a tiny little ring, which would be really cool. I can't really get to it through all these trees. But guys, if you have a creative eye, imagine this all cleared, which even just turning horses out here will make the property get cleared from them just walking around because imagine 1200 pounds, you know, trampling through this, they will knock it down, but I really don't want them to. Let's see if we can get through here, Co, without you getting poked. Because this is the irrigation system over here where I'm going to turn this into like a little bit of a ring, just like jumping course, right through here, straight line. Or my, everyone keeps on saying I need to have like fruit trees and stuff, but I don't know. I don't know. Maybe I might just keep it a sprinkler system for the horses to cool off and you never know. It's like our own big pasture field. This is so up to this corner of the property we're literally gonna walk every corner it's so shaded over here like you can have a cute little barn over in this corner too kojak loves it you guys are gonna have so much fun but look at all these sticks i have to pick up this weekend oh my goodness and what are these holes are these these oh yeah gopher turtles oh gosh great you know what that means we have to put a, a gate around them i don't think they've been used though for a while yeah, I don't know. That's pretty big. The farm is right over there. You can see the fence. We just walked through all these trees. How cool are they though? They're all lined. There's like one dead one over there. And then we have to start a big burn pile. But for the most part, this area is pretty cleared. And that one too. It just has a lot of dead limbs like that. So thankfully we got a tractor with the house. And I have to learn how to run it. Which my dad needs to get down here to show me how to do that even though I don't really want to. But now that we have toured the property on horseback, I'm going to go in and start working on the house and doing all the work I can do right now by myself. First, I have to take Kojak back to the farm and then get started on the house. Let's go. We're coming back here to look to see. Oh my gosh, wait a second, Jackie. This is part of the property. Is that part of the Yeah, so I just... Yeah. Oh wait, no, I see the fence sign. Okay, never mind. You, I lied. So see the fence is down here. We have to put that up. Wow, we should have Matt start working on that now. Oh, but look at that behind it. That was an old greenery. Kojak's like, get me out of here. We're walking the driveway. Now imagine all these azalea bushes trimmed down and then a big fence. And this is my loop around driveway. I'm gonna hang lights from the trees so they're like lit up at night because I just love lights everywhere, but I'm so excited. I want to live here now, but I've been taking my time with the house because I don't want to rush into anything and my house that I'm currently living in right now is not sold yet. So it's giving me time to actually think exactly what I want done to it. Well, I hope you all enjoyed that video and that little tour of the property. I'm so excited to show you guys the inside. So stay tuned for that because it is coming soon.